Plano police are investigating the disappearance of a beloved teacher's aide and mother of three. It's been almost one week since Kylie Doyle walked out of school. Maria Guerrero spoke with Doyle's worried family and police. Police say Lebanon Trail High School teacher's aide Kylie Doyle left work in Frisco last Friday morning and hasn't been seen or heard from since. We're all working to hopefully um, find Kylie as quick as possible. Michael Doyle in North Carolina says just about everything surrounding his daughter's disappearance is odd, beginning with when she walked out. It would be unusual for her to leave that earlier in the day, but she left around 11.40. The 43-year-old mother of three, he says, left with her keys and this notepad. Apparently she left her purse and all of her other belongings at home that morning. Uh, so she didn't have, she didn't even have her school ID with her and she had to actually sign in to get into school to, to uh, go to her class. That would lead me to believe that something was on her mind that morning. Also still missing, her black Hyundai Elantra with a broken right side mirror and a white decal on the back. Plano police say they don't know where she drove to from here, but she did not return to the Frisco school or her home in Plano. That, according to her husband, who reported her missing the next day. Where does the husband stand in this investigation? Uh, right now he's cooperating and um, he's been cooperating since he made the report. While police say there's no indication of anything nefarious and adults sometimes just leave. It's definitely an all hands on deck at this point because I think if she just wanted to be gone, then she would have just told somebody else that. Teachers, students at the school, they just love her, they appreciate her, um, and they're all, uh, you know, along with the family praying that uh, we find her quickly. Take another look at Doyle's car. It's a 2017 black Hyundai Elantra license plate KRZ9588, again with that broken right side mirror. Anyone with information is urged to call Plano Police. In Frisco, Maria Guerrero, NBC5.